Hey guys, it's Lenny and welcome to our channel. Radio, today I'm going to show you how to get the coloured helmets. This method was private, it's since been released, so it's on 7 cents. I didn't know this method until today. So if you want to get your blue, white, red, tan helmet that you normally can't get, I suggest to do this as soon as you can because being the time it is, there's usually an update either tonight my time, which is in a couple of hours, or yeah, very, very soon. So. But yeah, requirements for this glitch, you need to have two PlayStations or a really, really, really good friend that you trust with your account because they're going to have to log into your account. You also need to have an adversary outfit saved. So there's something like this one here with the purple helmet. I will leave a link in the description how to do that because I have made a video on that before. Um, so this is you on your first on the first PlayStation. And what you need to do is you need to go to biker suits and select the biker suit. Okay, so once we have that, we need to go and put a biker helmet on. And we need to save this outfit. So this is you on the first PlayStation. Okay, so you're the one who will be doing this part of the glitch. And your friend will be doing a completely different step. So what you're doing is just setting it up so that the outfit or the helmet will transfer over at the end. So... So what we have to do now is we have to go down to the biker helmets and we need to select the helmet that corresponds with the coloured bulletproof helmet that we want. So I'll be choosing the black ace of spade one. So that one there, that one will actually transfer into a white bulletproof helmet and I'll leave a link in the description of what helmets transfer to what and obviously a link to the founder or the founders and where I've seen this glitch, so yeah, massive shout out to them. But once you've selected that helmet and they got that outfit on, just save it in a spot. I was full of spots, so well, actually full of outfits, so I had to figure out which one I wanted to delete. And because I'm a bit dyslexic, I don't name them exactly what they are, and couldn't figure out what it was. But I actually save it over that spot there, which is the SE white. So once you got that saved, what you need to do is you need to put some glasses on. So just make sure that you have that orange save symbol there. So just going to go to interaction menu, go to style and go to accessories and just select a set of glasses. And once you've done that and you've got that save symbol, what you need to do is you need to make your way back to story mode. So once you're in story mode, you can either log out of your PlayStation or you can just simply wait there on the um, story mode screen with Franklin or Michael or Trevor or whoever it is so yeah just wait on that screen but you need to let your friend know once you're there not any time sooner than that so if you're online still not a good idea just make sure you go back to story mode so so I'm in story mode now as Franklin um, at this point you let your friend know but me having two PlayStations I just log on to my second PlayStation onto the same account and I'm just going to go to Options, Online, and go to Choose Character. And once you come into this Choose Character screen, or once your friend comes into this screen, so he's the one helping you, he just needs to sit here and not press any buttons. Okay, so they're just going to sit here the whole time. They're going to get kicked off this once you log back into your account on your PlayStation. So this is me back on the first PlayStation. and I'm just going to simply go to a invite only session. So what normally happens these days is you're going to get kicked back to story mode which is not an issue so you'll see here in a second I'm fast forwarding and then I will get put down and then I'll get kicked back to story mode straight away. So if this happens don't stress just go back to the invite only session and yeah you can continue the glitch so don't, yeah, don't be alarmed if you get kicked. So once we're back in a session, so invite only loads is quick, so that's what I suggest to do. What we need to do now, so we need to choose that adversary outfit we had. So that purple one I had, I need to go and find that in my inter interaction menu. And need to select that so we have that outfit on. So there it is there. Okay, and once you do that, just put a set of glasses on and then wait for that orange save symbol 
So there it is there on the bottom right hand side. And once you got that, just want to go back to story mode. So either down on the D-pad, back to story mode on Franklin, or just press your options button and go back to on to story mode from that, that way. Okay, once we're here, we need to tell our friend that we're back in story mode. He's going to log back into your account. He needs, before he goes on to GTA, he needs to find someone in a session. So as you can see, I got my friend there. And as soon as he gets that, double tap, you'll come back to the game. He needs to double tap to come back to the join session again. He needs to select X on that. And what's going to happen, it's going to kick him back to story mode. But before we get there, we're going to get the that invite or that alert to join our friend that we tried to join. So you'll see here, there you go, he's in a different targeting mode. I select X on that. And there we go, we're going back straight back into a online session. Now you shouldn't get kicked from here, but if you do, it doesn't matter. Just press pause online, invite only again. But we need to do this step. So this step here, we just need to buy something from our interaction menu, so a bit of ammo. And force a game save by changing our glasses, so we need to keep that helmet on. Okay, so if you remember back at the start of the glitch, we had this outfit on. And on the second PlayStation, we on the first PlayStation, we changed it to the adversary outfit. But being your friend on the second PlayStation, we'll still have this outfit. Okay, so once I do that, change the glasses and buy some ammo, back to story mode. So it's very important that your friend has a in a join session on someone else in a different online session before he goes back to GTA from his dashboard. Okay, so back to the first PlayStation. Tell your friend that you've done that part and you go back on to your PlayStation, go to an invite only session. All right, so you're gonna be kicked again. If you're not, just continue with the glitch, but as you can see there, I had the white helmet on. So just accept that if you get kicked and basically you go back to pause online, invite only, and then yeah, back into an invite only session and you shouldn't get kicked on the second time. But there you go, white helmet. So unless you had a modded account, you don't have that helmet and this is a cool way to get it. So yeah, just save it and yeah, continue on. That's it for the video guys, I hope you enjoyed it and thanks for